I am so sorry about all the comments from the YouTube community. I just watched the ones where you went through the comments section. I support what you're doing and I hope it'll get better. Wait a second. This one can't be real. I'm a YouTuber and my friend is and this is Domain because this is not what I do and I have 23,000 on a O video you at A. Fuck you Jelly Apocalypse, you make stupid videos every single time so stupid they offend people dick. Bag and you hurt people's feelings, people can comment if they want to. Welcome to You're Not Funny. You just think you're so flawless, don't you? You need to do a video about your own flaws for once, you narcissistic son of bitch. People order our patties. And I'm British. I'm now famous. And I'm British. Welcome to YouTube, where the clickbait is real. And I'm British. That was an advertisement. It ha! I don't have to watch the advertisement because I have YouTube Red. I fucking love Mannix. How dare you tarnish its pure name, built off of honest work, and the great minds of Richard Levinson and William Link. See you, my good sir. Jello, you fucking stupid hypocrite. You are a pop, pop. Wow, I got a subscriber. Just pick something you're good at and do it a million times. Welcome to Tumblr. Welcome to fanfiction.net. Welcome to Kickstarter. Welcome to DeviantArt. Welcome to YouTube Comments Bar. What? I'll just pretend this is welcome to Reddit. I love watching Lore in a Minute. This video wasn't good at all! Cowboy Bebop movie was the first movie that my wife and I saw together. Years later, my wife died. You didn't get what anything but Paloo means? Seriously? It was the theme color of the guy from that she episode. She doesn't like to use blue because, because it was the color of the guy when her ex applied to the The show I'm pretty much be applied to any show. Because Ed was painting her toenails blue. Did you watch the show? It's called Nuance, and you have to be a little smart to appreciate it. Name of song when he gets pushed out the spaceship? Well, I'm sorry to be annoying, but when is the next Welcome to Blank coming out? <laughs> oh. Wow. Rebel Taxi reference. Yep. Hi. <sighs> what? And before some 12-year-old posting a Lenny. I present to you, the flying booty. It's ah! my best talk. It hurt my throat. The comment section is so cringy. Yamotokan XD needs to frickin' die in a fire. And so should all weeb game, anime band, and cartoon fandoms. Next idea? So this is basically the Angry Birds movie. Wow, I have such bad taste. <laughs> Thank you for the comments, guy. I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I uh, I can't not like this because it reminds me of Sans. <laughs> Please make us so this is basically for Undertale. Ow, oh, flails. Oh, shit. shit fuck. I, I hit the microphone. Can you do games like Undertale and Minecraft Plus? What is it with you getting all the names wrong? It is so annoying. She's a woman. Of course she's going to avoid responsibility. Do one about this sexy motherfucker. Beat. They show is gay, and yet 21-year-olds like, and their oats are fat jelly beans. Is Italy a city in France? Is this sarcasm? If this isn't sarcasm, I will hunt you down and smash your face into a geography book. My parents said they'd shove my face into the keyboard if I played it any louder, but I don't believe <laughs> The porn of that twink slut has been pretty rad. Chloe Bourgeois rocks my socks and you'd suck my mm-mm if I had one, that is. Oh, and the reason they don't reveal their identities is because that one of the biggest mysteries of the show would be over. Smarty. I can see that whatever illusionary battle you've created in your head, you've won. Well done, matey. Arr. <laughs> Some of us are too busy dealing with reality to bother with deluded keyboard warriors, though. Take care now, you hear? Well, first flick! <laughs> Stop licking the screen, Timmy. Does anyone else think the comic was made after the video? <laughs> I know it's been like four years, but please bring back the Welcome to Blank videos. I know I can't be the only one asking. Only you can prevent wildfires. I meant to say, only you can prevent wildfires. Please do. 
This is Hentalia Axe's powers. Pretty hot. Freaking prosy team, I swear that genius is everywhere. Yeah, I, I he is a genius. And very handsome. You thought you could sneak fast in here without me noticing, didn't you, Jello? Well, you didn't! And you! You thought you could make this comment without me noticing! Didn't you? More Nedroid, and I will donate a buck or two to whatever gay Patreon or whatever you have. I wrote a short part of a crappy story for you. Please give feedback. I love your videos. The Heights and Depths of a Scavenger's Adventure Chapter 1. A typical regular plain morning. The air was cool but soft at the same time that Calvin awoke. The dense silver clouds guarding the small town of Stingard as the sun, hidden from the villagers, rose high into the morning sky. This is like word for word the opening chapter of Aragon. What King of Ghetto Ass Genie grants a single fucking wish? I would wish for. 10,000 legal American dollars that isn't stolen from anywhere but the lottery. Wishes are contact sensitive. 10 out of 10! What have you? Art is dead. Hey, Jello, do you need a kid voiceover? I have this sex, 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 sexiest voice for a kid my age, and I'm going to music school for seven years now. I sing very well. I can sing something for you. I can make accents. I am Russian. Just give me a good mic, please, mate. I'm too poor. I want to eat, mate. Please help. I have no money. I'm 13 years old Russian kid with diabetes. I actually have diabetes. I want some what? I mean tea. Please, mate, let me be in your reads. That's just a weird comment. I, mm, hi, and, uh, I, uh, I like you guys have a mm, good channel. Uh, just wanted to tell you that I'ma watch your channel with some popcorn and, uh, popcorn. Oh, yeah, popcorn. Oh, yes, oh, yes, popcorn. So good inside my mouth. Slurp. Watch video. Meh, funny. Go to comments. Read comments. Die a little inside. I'm am dead. If she's 20, and I am 14, so my age isn't on the clock. She's ready to suck my cock. Uh, I brought the gangs. Let's do this! Dun 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 dun! Bring it! Dun 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 dun! You fucking ruined Shantae for me, which isn't good as I want to work at WayForward. Do welcome to Cinemassacre, aka Angry Video Game Nerd. Would you be able to make so this is basically gorillas? <laughs> So this is basically Seduce Me XT. <laughs>
I am only defending my favorite show because I don't like it when anything involves gays or lesbians. Are you serious? I don't like it when anything involves gays or lesbians. <sighs> well, time to forget this channel forever. I know it's sad because it's the series finale and all, but I can't be the only one who wants to diddle the lady peg there, right? It's sad that not many people read the newspaper anymore. Yeah. The newspaper had so many classics, like Jalapeno, or Galvin and Habanero. Best part about webcomics is when they get a shitty fan dub. Dear Jello, hear me out right quick. Unless you already have future content planned for this channel, I would like to see what happens if you decide to do Welcome To videos on perhaps TV shows or video games if you want. Since you said that this is the last Welcome To video other than comment responses, I'm guessing you will just ignore what I said. Have day! It finally comes to an end. Thanks for all the laughs, Jello. I know you didn't fully enjoy making this series, but I enjoyed watching it, and I'm glad that you gave it proper closure rather than quietly canceling it. Keep up the great work. As lewd as it may have been, I would have died to see you welcome to Fat Life, the Facebook of fetishes. <laughs> Still excellent job, guys. You never disappoint. Thank you for watching, and a huge thank you to all of the fabulous voice actors who lent their voices to this project. It's always a ton of fun to get to work with you guys, especially the ones I don't normally get to. I'd like to give a special shout out to the awesome crew at Silly Philly Studios. I've worked with these guys a bunch of times in comic dubs, and the Hamtaro parody, and these comment videos, and they're always a bunch of fun. And they have a great animation and voice acting channel that you should check out. They do lots of parodies for Pokemon, League of Legends, Neko Atsume, Undertale, a bunch of other stuff, and a number of comic dubs. And if you like what we do on this channel, then you'll definitely enjoy their work, and you should check out their stuff and totally subscribe to them. It would mean a lot. Thanks!